trying to show you how to get your Rocksmith 2014 cable working. I tried, if you're like me, tried everything, you've looked everywhere, tried every suggestion, including installing all that stuff in the BIOS and uh, all that junk anyway. Um, so the fastest way I figured out how to fix the cable uh, is access your sound settings and your PC settings. Go down here to manage sound devices. Now in here's where you're going to want to look. You can see over here to the left that I don't have the cable plugged in. Now the fix that I've found, as stupid as it sounds, is literally to plug the cable in and unplug the cable. So when you plug the cable in, and just keep repeating this until you see an input device pop up here. It'll take a while for anything to appear here on the left side of the screen sometimes. Allow me to unplug and plug in. Okay, there you go. It'll refresh when it detects a hardware change. And you wait a second here, and this is what happens when it errors up. You're going to wait for a second, and eventually you'll see driver error pop up under the uh, device settings, but you'll see the little exclamation point flag there. But you can open this menu and just unplug and plug in, unplug, plug in, unplug, plug in, unplug, plug in, out, in, bear with me, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in. That time it worked. I don't know what what it is, but you see it even comes up Rocksmith Guitar USB Adapter. There's no more error over here on the sign, and you can even double check that by going back. And let's see, where is it? I think you go back one more. Yeah, down here to Devices, Audio, Rocksmith Guitar USB Adapter. And typically it'll have driver error here if it has the little flag over there, but now it doesn't, and it'll work. Like I said, I don't know what it is. You just have to bear with me and uh, bear with it and keep unplugging and plugging in it. And the fastest way to see if it's going to work is, again, through managed sound devices. You'll see almost as soon as you plug it in, you'll see it come up. Um, instead of having to wait over here for to see if you got a red flag or not. Um, the only way it's going to work is if, is if it comes up in this menu. Now it's registered as a microphone, as an input device that the game can see, and it'll operate with the game. Anyway, guys, again, if you were like me, you were pulling your hair out. You tried everything. Fresh installing windows, I read some people did. Well, this is a fresh install for me, so there's no reason I should have to do that. Um, so, yeah, until there's a more permanent fix. Oh, and I want to add that I did try cleaning the USB head. I tried cleaning the, um, the emergency disconnectors. You know, their, their connections and everything. Uh, I've tried plugging into multiple USB ports. Nothing worked but this. And this, I might also add, worked with every USB port. So even if it was, uh, I tried with every USB port and I got the same problem. But the same solution worked in every port. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, also, as a quick note, it'll appear as something different. Sometimes it'll say USB microphone device or USB whatever. Sometimes it'll say Hawksmith. Um, and they say that's because there's not enough power in the cable or whatever, and they, they'll try to tell you to buy a powered USB adapter, but that just, from what I've, I've seen, someone saying that that doesn't work either, even though another person said that it did. So anyway, guys, again, I know this is probably the stupidest fix for anything you've ever seen, um, but it does work for reasons unknown. Anyway, take care. Rock on.